What's happening, Internet? Sean here, Mahalo.com. And in this step, we'll be diving even deeper into figuring out our hardware. So this step is more or less for a power user that wants a really powerful gaming machine or rendering machine or something of that nature. So we'll be diving even deeper using a couple other tools to find out what's the bottleneck on our computer. All right, now that we've done a basic diagnosis of our system using the Windows Experience Index, and just a reminder, this index is based off of a 7.9 system, not a 10.0 system. So these scores right here are actually pretty high. So now that we've just done a basic diagnosis, we can do an advanced diagnosis. It'll give us a little bit more information about our system. And to do this, we'll simply go to futuremark.com. And from here, you can download a couple advanced benchmarking programs. One of those being 3DMark and another one being PC Mark. And 3D Mark is more for your games, and then PC Mark is more of a just a PC system benchmark. The results you'll see from 3D Mark give you quite a bit of information. First off, you get a score after the benchmark is complete, which you can rate against other systems of, of similar hardware. And we're given our processor, how many physical processors we have, as well as logical or virtual processors, more information about our video card, also, the price of our video card, let's say, for instance, if we wanted to run two video cards simultaneously, if our video card allows that, we're able to see these options here if we wanted to buy a card. Another thing, too, we can see all of the chips of RAM that we have installed in our computer currently and the speed at which they're running. Then the score for each test and the frame rate we had per test. Another really helpful tip, you're able to click on this right here. And it shows us a way to improve our system, which simply says there's a newer video driver out there. It also suggests upgrading our video card. As well as that, from the main website, you can also find games that are coming out. And you can see if your system is able to play the game that's going to be coming out. And also, if your system cannot play the game, then you can just go to the System Builder. And from here, you can piece together a system. And at the top, we give you the estimated 3D Mark score of that system you're putting together. So you really have a good idea of how powerful of a system you're putting together, and also a price of the parts you have. So just by using those tools is a really good way to fine tune your system, see if there's anything you need to add to it, and also a good way to rate products that you're looking at for adding to your system. So hopefully this benchmark gave you a little bit more information about your system, so you know about one part you might want to fix, replace, or upgrade. So in the next step, at the end of this video, just click on one of the related links to the part you'd like to upgrade. And I'll tell you everything you need to know about that part so we can upgrade that part. And I'll show you in the video after that one, I'll show you how to physically install it into your system. All right, guys, and just a reminder, this video is one step in the process of elimination to finding out why your PC is running so slow. So if you just stumbled upon this video, you might want to go to step one, and that will be in the description of this video. And remember, guys, you can send any of your problems to me for viruses, spyware, and PC performance that I haven't covered in this series. Just send those to requests at mahalo.com. And remember, only you can prevent spyware, viruses, and all that bad stuff on the Internet.